zero and zero in two starts, but an excellent ERA, 174. A lot of ground balls, great ratio, 16 to six ground ball to fly ball ratio. He's going to get a lot of weak outs. And call strike three. And then come back outside with Ray. Not bad. Ross back to the plate. And a ground ball to the right side. Easy play for Donnie Murphy. And that'll do it. Zanino, a long home run last night. Boy, he gets sawed off here. Right near the bag at second. Donnie Murphy has it. And that is out number one. And that cutter lived up to his name. It almost cut that bat in half. Up the middle. Murphy behind second. Going to the bag. He wins that race. And he got the sliding Romero. Nice play by Donnie Murphy to get the force. Thanks, though, so... He's got some base stealing ability. Right, a butt, trying to bunt it over the mound, and Robbie Ross reverses his field very nicely. Nice play by the 24 year old left hander. 43 strikes and a shot up the middle. On the outfield grass, Elvis long throw, and Cano is retired. Nice play by Elvis Andrews. Further into the game, keep his pitch count down, throw more strikes, and man, that's exactly what he's doing. How about that? 72 pitches, and he is through six innings. That's a seven-pitch, sixth inning for Ross on three ground balls. Zanino is grounded to second and flied to fairly deep center. That's a pretty good pitch. That's a real good pitch. Elvis plants, throws, and got it. Great play by Elvis Andrews from shallow left field. Throwing out Zanino. Ross to the line. And another one-two tapped right back to him. That's the third one tonight, and a similar result. And the skipper says, yeah, nice going, too. And Robbie finished, and he does get a nice standing ovation. Most of the crowd of 26,628 on their feet. A well-deserved ovation for Robbie Ross, Jr. Pitching change underway at Globe Live Park back after this on Fox Sports Southwest.